my eggs usually come out more perfect than this. It's really like a mess right now. But it's easy to make in the microwave. You just coat the, coat the bottom of the bowl with like extra virgin olive oil and put it in for 120. Then again, I've done some better ones. You make this bacon extra crispy by putting it in the microwave for 40 seconds. It's easy. Everybody can do it. And today we're going to be making ramen noodle hash browns. So we have ramen noodles, we have eggs, and the seasoning. And this is the microwave cooker. So this is easy. You put the ramen at the bottom, fill it up to the um, line with water, and then you put it in for three minutes. Let's go. Yeah, those eggs actually came out better than the ones over there. And I even added tomatoes to it. So now we have this step. We have to stir it. This is just exactly like AC. Also, make sure it's drained. I think the eggs does that. And then we're going to add this stuff. Make sure it retains its shape too. Okay, so I added my hash browns to the pan, put in olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, and then put the stew on to like five, six to eight. It looks interesting. It just looks like a mound now. I can't wait to eat the results. And these are the ramen hash browns. When they cool, I will give them a taste test. And yeah, they did come out good. They could have been crispier, but. I don't want to burn them. This is a result of the TikTok ramen. Let's give it a taste test. There we go. Oh my god. This stuff actually tastes like hash browns. 10 out of 10 and there will, more be will be more recipes for me to try and recreate, especially ramen wise. See ya!